So what's up everyone, it is finally that time of year again, December 23rd, which means that it is Festivus. But there is probably lots of you out there that don't even know what Festivus is, especially if you didn't grow up in the 90s or have never watched the show Seinfeld. So today we're going to talk about what exactly Festivus is and its traditions and how it came to be a theme that some people celebrate. So let's talk about it. So the Festivus holiday originated from the TV show Seinfeld, from the episode The Strike from Season 9, Episode 10, which premiered on December 18th of 1997. And for this episode, it was just like any other episode of Seinfeld, following the daily life of the four main characters being Jerry, Kramer, Elaine, and George. And for this episode, of course, Kramer is going back to work at H&H Bagels, ending the 12-year strike, but then after just a couple days, goes on strike again as he's not allowed to leave early for Festivus. Tech Festivus! Hey, no bagel, no bagel, no bagel, no bagel, no bagel! Hey, no bagel, no bagel, no bagel, no bagel, no bagel! Jerry during this episode is dating a girl named Gwen, but in certain lighting she is more attractive and in certain lighting is not as attractive. Gwen, Gwen, wait! Ah! Bad lighting on the porch. And during the episode, Elaine gave a guy a number on the back of her sub card, which she was close to getting a free sub. So during the episode, Elaine goes on a hunt to try and get this card back. 24 stamps and I become a submarine captain. So what does that mean? And then, of course, for the storyline for George is where we end up finding out about the holiday Festivus, where George's dad, when he was a kid, did not like Christmas at all, so he made his own holiday known as Festivus. And during this episode, George is getting teased about Festivus and everything until the end of the episode, where we get the iconic scene of Festivus at George's dad's house. So, of course, now that we kind of went over the storyline of this episode, let's focus on what exactly happened at that Festivus dinner. So, to talk about what Festivus is and what exactly happened, it's divided into a few different parts, so let's talk about part by part. So, the first part of the holiday Festivus is the aluminum pole, which is basically where you just get a random aluminum pole and put it up in your living room in place of the Christmas tree, because since it's against Christmas, instead of the tree, you have an aluminum pole. It's made from aluminum. Very high strength to weight ratio. I find your belief system fascinating. Then, of course, the rest of the traditions of Festivus happen at Festivus dinner. Where Festivus dinner, you make a nice dinner for your family and friends. But then before you start dinner, of course, is the Aaron of Grievances, which this was one of my favorite parts from the episode, honestly. And for the errands of Grievances, you share with your family and friends all the problems you have with all of them throughout the last year. The Festivus begins with the airing of grievances. I got a lot of problems with you people. Now, you're gonna hear about it. You, Kroger, my son tells me your company stinks. Oh, God. Boy, we'll get yours in a minute. Kroger, you couldn't smooth a silk sheet if you had a hot date with a babe. I lost my train of thought. And then, of course, the other part of Festivus dinner, which happens when everyone is done eating, is the feats of strength, where in the Seinfeld episode, George's dad, Frank, challenges him to a fight, and until George wins, Festivus is not over. Kramer, you, you can't go! Who's gonna do the feats of strength? How about George? <laughs> Good thinking, Cougar. Until you pin me, George. Festivus is not over. Oh, please, somebody stop this. And with all of that, that is what exactly Festivus is. A very simple holiday that if you don't celebrate Christmas, or even if you do celebrate Christmas, is definitely a fun one to celebrate. All you have to have is an aluminum pole, and then the rest of it is just pretty simple to do. Overall, I really loved the episode, The Strike from Seinfeld. It's a really iconic one and probably my favorite one from the whole series. It just gave so many iconic moments and I love the holiday festivist they invented for the show. And with all that said, that is it for today's video. Everyone hopefully did enjoy. If you didn't already know what Festivus is, I hope this video helped you get to know about Seinfeld and what exactly happened in that episode to make what Festivus is. 
And of course, if you do know what Festivus is and you love Seinfeld, hopefully you still enjoyed this video just to see more about what Festivus is. But anyways, that's it. Today's day 11 of the 12 days of uploads. I have one more video coming for all of you tomorrow, so make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss that video. And I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye.